part two of our quick milk sucky sucky straw experiment slash thing videos. Let's get into it. Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK, my name's MJ and if you joined us for part one where we reviewed the fruity cereal and the wizard flavour of the, it doesn't taste of wizards, it's just got multiple flavours in, or it claims to, uh, of the sucky sucky milky straws, then you would have seen that we had quite a bit of fun, uh, then you would have seen that we had quite a bit of fun, uh, we're now doing the next two flavours which is jammy biscuits and creamy choco. Shout out to Maverick Baking, go and check out her channel because she recently reviewed some of these quick milk magic milkshake straws uh, and her video was funnier, much better than ours. So let's start off with the creamy choco flavour, which is like Oreo, I guess. We're no longer in the year of the Oreo, guys, so I refuse to put the logo on the screen. It's just the way it is. Oh, okay, this is the first one that's had a hashtag waft, so that, that bodes well. I've already got my milk glass. Right, let's see if we've got Oreo things happening here. I was disappointed by the other two flavours, if you've not seen the review. And hey, guys, as I suck, why don't you donate to us on Patreon? you'll be able to have your say on what we review and things like that. But you do get um, some exclusive content like soda swirls and monthly Q&As and uh, best befores and behind the scenes and schedule updates. It's worth going on there, guys. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Already this is better than the other two. <laughs> on the other two, I did mention that you sort of need to keep the milk in the chamber. To get the most flavour. Hmm. Yeah. It's a sweet, milky, creamy chocolate. Very specifically, doesn't taste just like chocolate. Definitely tastes like the nice mixture between the sweetness of the vanilla. Uh, I'm not sure if I say vanilla actually, but just like a vague sort of sweety creaminess. Um, and the milkshake. You could argue that you would get that flavour from a chocolate flavour milkshake, but the chocolate is not as intense. And it's kind of artificial, it's kind of like those chocolate candies that you can get. Uh, that is not too bad though. It's not mind blown by any stretch of the imagination, but it's definitely better than the other few and you can definitely vaguely tell what that is trying to be. I give that one a low three stars. Which means that over the course of the last video as well, I've done these in ascending order. So the last one, the Jammy Biscuit, which appears to be a jammy dodger, should be the best one. Now, I got this from B&M Bargains several months ago, so I don't know if they do them any longer. But I have seen some of these flavours in, in their own individual packs. This is like a big multi-pack. <sighs> Fair play, that really, really smells like jammy dodgers. <laughs> it looks like that. Sealed straw, as with all the others. Let's give it a go. Get a little mix. <laughs> Mama. Right, I'm going to hold it in the chamber oh. for my first sip this time. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. That's mental. Literally, somehow, managed to do it in ascending order because that is easily the best one. That tastes but on of jammy biscuits. Like, that is bang on the flavour that it says it is. Not too sweet either. Yeah, that's very pleasant. Very pleasant. You get the sweet, rich, strawberry jam flavour, and it is a jam, it's an intense sweetness, and it's very pure. And then you get the biscuity flavour. It nails the flavour, it tastes the best out of all of them, and it's Quite impressive, I'd give that one a low four stars. Hang on, did we? One, two, three, four. I'm pretty sure I gave them one, two, three, four. That would be a Food Review UK first, I think. Sequential products increasing in quality. Wow, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you can find this, worth a go. I think it was extremely cheap. It was like a pound or something. Um, for 20 straws, that's good value if you ask me. What's that, a 5p a straw? 
So I spent 20p doing this review. That is a cheap review. But hey, food reviews don't come cheap all the time. You should donate to us on Patreon. Did I say this video? Literally think I did. Bye guys, thanks for watching. Thanks to Maverick Bacon for the inspiration for this video. Go and check out our channel, it's really funny, bye. Chicken on the floor of my car. Will I eat that? Yeah.